Hello everyone, Shane Barron here, PGA professional for All Asia Golf. Today we are talking about putting. Now putting makes up 40% of your score, so this, this is extremely important that we get this correct. We have some basic fundamentals that we can do to make you a better putter. We're at the beautiful Banyan Golf Course here in Wahin, Thailand. It is gorgeous. Amazing practice facilities. We've been at the range this morning. This is only one of the putting greens, which is absolutely huge. Bunker, big bunker over here. Fantastic facility. The average golf pro is having around 30 putts for 18 holes and the average amateur golfer is having around 40 putts for 18 holes. So if we can get that down to low 30s, we're going to take off a lot of shots very quickly. So firstly, we're going to talk about the grip and how the putter grip is a little bit different to our standard grip. So our standard grip, we are, we're trying to grip the club in our fingers so we have a good wrist hinge in our swing. But with putting, we, we don't want too much wrist action. So what we need to do is have the club running a little bit more down our forearms. So you see my forearm and the shaft makes one line through our lifeline, not in our fingers. So you get the putter running a little bit more through our lifeline, through our palm. And then you'll see my forearm and the shaft makes one line. So that's extremely important. Then we have a lot less wrist action. So even if we do get a little bit wristy, it's still coming through fairly square. Second little thing here is getting our eyes over the golf ball. So I'm using a simple little putting mirror here to make sure my eyes are over the ball. And then we're looking at the same line all the time, whether it's a one foot putt or a hundred foot putt. So really important little fundamental. If you don't have a putting mirror, a simple little thing like just grabbing a golf ball here, sitting up in your, in your putting posture, drop a ball from in between the eyes. And then you've got the ball underneath your eyes there. So a simple little test like that, just to try and make sure your eyes are over the golf ball. From there, so our eyes are over the golf ball. We've got our, we've got our good grip where the golf club is running a little bit more through our palms. From there, we need to keep our head nice and stable, yeah? We don't want, our, we don't want any head movement at all. One big mistake a lot of amateur golfers make is this movement right here where they hit the putt and their eyes follow the ball and they follow the putter and the ball like this here and the, the golfer comes out of their posture and they're looking at the outcome a little bit too early. So we need to be, make sure we're just staying here thinking about the process, make sure we complete the process. So we want to stay nice and steady here, make sure the putter has stopped here, then tilt the head to the side like this and then we remain in posture. We're not getting out of our posture like that there. Especially on the short parts, this is where people get themselves in trouble. They'll have a little, a little putt like this for par. And of course, you know, we want to make that par putt, but then they get so concerned about the outcome right here that everything moves very quickly. And all of a sudden we've got out of our posture, we've hit a poor putt, and I've left myself a longer putt coming back than I had in the first place, so. 